effort to maximize the space efficiency of my home office and studio. We've uh, decided instead of mounting a whiteboard on the wall, we were going to try this Krylon dry erase paint. And as you can see, it's on the door insets of our computer armoire. Simple wipe down. You can see the blue text goes, but not all of the color goes. Let's try using some Windex. Okay, here we go. There. That's the blue. Well, there it is, folks. That's how well the Krylon dry erase paint works. Not well at all. So we're going to try this again. Um, part of the problem may have been that I didn't wait for this one to fully cure before I tested it. So what I'm going to do, I've already sanded it down. I got rid of that drip that was over here. We're going to give it another coat. And then we're going to wait at least 72 hours before I try writing on it. Let's see how that works. While we wait for the other side to dry, let's uh, give it a try on the outside. I painted all four of the insets. So you can see I've got some drips here, but I don't care too much about that. So it's supposed to look rusticy anyway. So... We're going to test how well this erases. And again, since I don't have a whiteboard eraser, we're back to a folded paper towel. So let's get after it. That doesn't work well. And we have Windex on a paper towel. That helps, but it's still not all it's doing is smearing it around. So, all right, that's it. Um, this panel has been curing for at least two weeks. So I know it's not an uncured, unset paint on here. This is just, just not effective. So there it is. If you like my videos, remember to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Feel free to go back into the old catalog by clicking my channel and then clicking on the videos link. There's lots of decent stuff back there you may be interested in. And like I always say to you folks, be busy, be productive, be safe, but most of all, be blessed. I'll talk to you later. Thanks for watching.